Hey, what's going on, everybody? You can call me Snippy, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Beta 1.7.3. What are we going to do this episode? That's the main question. That's the big question that I've been asking myself as I walked around for two minutes already. I mean, we do have objectives here. We kind of did all of them, though, besides, like, this. Obviously, that's those are quite tall orders. We've already spent more than a few episodes wandering around and, well, literally both episodes. We spent plenty of time wandering around and we spent plenty of time wandering around and enjoying the scenery. The nostalgic scenery. But, that is not enough. That is not active pursuit of any goals, right? Okay, I have decided upon a goal. Actually, I also remembered the last one, but I have decided upon a goal for the episode. So, I don't remember if that egg was important or not, but I do know what is important. These two string, these these are Spider Bro's remains. Um, after the unfortunate, you know, he you know, unfortunate incident where he, where he fell in battle, uh, it, it truly was a tragedy, but it's something that we can make up for. It's not even that complicated either. I mean, it's, it's actually quite the simple procedure. Oh my god, there's iron and stuff in here? I, for, I totally forgot if, if I ever even knew that. So that's where all my iron went. After the incident, I probably started... I probably started smelting more. <laughs> so I, we spent last episode mining for no reason. Oh well. I mean, we didn't get any diamonds, so it really was pointless, because that is a goal of ours, to get more diamonds and, and, and re-get, re regain all of our diamond gear. But until then, uh, we have some current goals to do around the base. Uh, I want to decorate a little bit more of the house, a little bit. Just relax a little bit. Oh my... <laughs> I forgot about this mushroom farm. I remember the red one that was underground, but this one up here... Man, it is just... It's efficient, let's put it that way. If I seriously wanted to use mushroom stew, I, I, I could use, I could just use it as much as I want with no repercussions at all because there's just so many mushrooms around. And it, even more than them being around, I know where they are, you know what I mean? I don't know why I feel so much like mystery with that spot. I don't, I don't know why. I think I threw myself for a loop at one point because I was like talking about deja vu there or something and now it's just like permanent. Why is there one egg in here? This is, this whole chest is a mess, I'm gonna be honest. Where did I put the other mushrooms? If not there, then where? What in the world is this organization? Okay. Let's go resurrect spider bro. That shouldn't be too hard, right? The only real question I have is which God damn it. Which of the shrines are going to work? That is the true question. Hello sheep. Ow, fall damage. You know what's really nice? When armor would actually just prevent damage straight up. That that was a wonderful time. I don't think it'll be on video because uh, uh I wasn't talking but I must have been on the very edge of its explosion because it did no damage to me. The creeper hole's still kind of there. Uh, we'll, worry, we'll worry about that another time. Um, yeah, my armor totally stopped it, which is interesting. The legendary cactus. Origin object. Interesting, okay. And then what did I write over here? Ow. Well, there's some damage. <laughs> Signing of the Pact, Grober Catalyst. Oh yeah, <laughs> this is the wool that made me tame him in the first place, and it was right down here, as a matter of fact. Look, see, all because of what I did, all because of the peace that I brought. Now the sheep can roam freely in these lands, and there's absolutely no more bloodshed that is unnecessary in nature. Well, that means that that shrine has had its use. That shrine has had its impact, and if anything is going to bring something back from the dead, it's going to be the origin object 
prematurely. So, how are we gonna do this? What is that? Oh. Oh. <laughs> it doubles up as a cactus farm. <laughs> Uh, and it and as it should because this is the legendary cactus not all the other ones that appear from it it's just singular all the other ones they try to take the throne but they cannot this is a seat only one can sit in okay man i gotta build stuff like this in my uh current world anyway how are we gonna do this ritual uh i have the two string and I suppose all I really have to do is sacrifice it, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 Okay, here we go. Ow! God damn it. These were not meant to be stood upon. Do I have any kind of speech for this? I guess so. I really have to come up with this stuff on the fly. Oh, playing Minecraft and commentating over it's so hard. Okay. <clears throat> Once upon a time, there was a spider. A spider that I would come across on my daily adventures. As after the morning sun rose and the world was blanketed in a soft warmth. The creatures and degenerates of the night would wither away and rot into nothing, while the beings that cling to the very ground they walk upon... Oh, yeah, that's a good one. The spiders, they would remain. But one of those spiders, among them all, among us, all of the spiders, there was one. Spider bro. A legendary spider if there ever was one. Or he would never lose a battle. Or he would never stake his claim upon my life. Because he was a friend. If you will, he was a bro. He may have been a spider. And at night, he may have gotten uh, quite the temper. But he and I saw eye to eight eyes far more often than anyone would ever expect. And really, that's all it takes. From then, it was set into fate itself that this spider would go on. And if nothing proves it more, then let it be this, that he fought with me to the death, saving me from an ambush that very well could have ended my life. In my time of need, he sacrificed himself for my sake. And so, I, if it sacrifices a part of me, so be it. But let this spider have another chance to breathe. Shit. <sighs> Let's see. Um... Nothing's really happening. Okay, let's come back at daytime and, and, and maybe everything will be better. Ooh. Skeletons. Ooh. Oh, oh my Ooh. god! Get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, hey there, buddy. Hey, hi. How you doing, man? You thought you could cut me off? Okay, they are mad. An egg. <laughs> this will guide me home. That's all it takes is an egg. Oh, man, I, I kind of wish I made that a back door because that sure would be useful. Yeah, it really would actually because there's no entrance from this whole area. Oh, come on. We can make it. 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 Get up. Get up. Get up. All right, we're fine. We are a-okay. Now I guess it's time to see what the morning brings. Ow, that was bad. Ugh. Out of my way, you degenerates. Uh oh. I heard him. Did you guys hear that? You heard that, right? Not you, creeper. 
Get out of here, you green bastard. What are you here for? You don't belong here. I heard something. I swear I heard him. I swear I heard him. He has to be here. Right? Spider bro. <gasps> there he is! Is that really him? Why do I feel like it's not him? I guess we'll find out. Ooh. Oh god, I'm out of arrows! <sighs> Apparently the, uh... Wait a minute. Does the X combo work if you just swing the bow? You don't even need to use the arrow? That's something I need to test. I guess we're gonna test it right now. Spider bro, is that you? Spider bro? Is that you? Ah! No, it's definitely not! No, it's not! No, it's not! No, it's not! No, it's not! Didn't even drop any string. No, that was nothing. That was an asshole spider. That was not him. Is it me? Is that creeper running really fast? X combo, baby. That actually works. That actually works! This whole time, my teachings have been to use one arrow and two sword swings. You have been bested! I have enhanced the art! The art form has has been advanced upon! <laughs> what the hell? What are the odds? Why is that possible? What? Okay, I guess the arrow, uh, the bow does as much damage as the arrows. Is that actually a thing? Now I have to go test this, like, meleeing something with it. Anyway. Our, our goal, right? Okay, spider bro. For real this time. And... Ah! 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 Where did you even just come from? Ah, ah, X combo! Ah! I mean... Okay, that didn't... Uh, mm, mm, how much damage did that do? I don't know. I don't know. Um, probably not as much as an arrow does. Probably. I gotta do more thorough testing on an enemy that actually has full health. And then, and then I gotta compare it to my fists. And then I gotta compare that to an axe or something. Or, or a shovel or, or a pickaxe or... Spider bro? You're here, right? A, a zombie died here. Speaking of feathers, though, that egg that, that helped guide me back home. <gasps> Spider bro! It really is you! No way! Um, um, oh god! Ow! Why? Why? Stop! Stop! You're better than this! You're better than this! You're better than this! I know you are! Oh, see? See, it really is him. Spider bro! It really is you! <laughs> oh. See, he heard me. He just had to. He just had to be rehabilitated a little bit. It's a little bit. It's a bit of a shock to be brought back from death. I'm sure. You just had to be a little. You know. You had, I had to jog your memory. Look, he's all happy. He, oh, look how happy he is. Yippee! You know all that stuff. All right. Anyway, I guess that's what objective accomplished. Ah, see, I told you guys. All you have to do is. You just gotta. Do your thing, you know what I mean? And it'll work. It'll work. It's, maybe you could call that a miracle. I call that, I just did what I had to do. That's all there is to it. Anyway, that's an objective done. Harry, hey man, how nice of you to show up right as I say the word done on cue. Hey man, how you doing? Off you go. No? What are you doing? Why are you circling me? Being awfully cryptic, Terry. Why is he walking like that? He's looking at me through the trees! What, are you just showing off the fact that you can go under one block to get gaps and I can't anymore in this version, huh? Alright, fine. Anyway, there was that random egg that helped me guide my, guide me back home. How the hell... Is there... Was there always a grass arrow up there? I'm gonna go look at that. That... Freaked me out. It really did. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> because I, I never saw a chicken. So how'd the egg get there? That's an instance where the egg definitely came before the chicken, but okay. Alright. What is this? Oh, no. It's just random land. Uh, what, what did I expect it to be? Of course it is. Okay. I never noticed that, though. Even though I've been living here for so damn long. 
Anyways, let's get to the other ob objective of the episode. I want to decorate the house a little bit more. Uh, there's some, there's some, wee. There's some little areas that I have left sparsely decorated, and they were kind of supposed to be that way. But uh, here, let me show you what I mean. Um, <clears throat> what is that Yoshi sound where, where you like eat the apple in Yoshi's Island, Baby Island, whatever? <laughs> Something like that. Anyway, this area, I have left it intentionally, um, I guess, barren. There's just something really old Minecraft about this, you know what I mean? Stone, clean stone hallways with glass in between them. I mean, not so much the window outside, actually. That's why I don't think I wanted that initially, but... Like, something about rooms designed like this... Call it liminal spaces, if you will. But there's just something so old Minecraft about it. And that was the intention. Um, but I don't know why. I've just always looked at these and it's like, yeah, these are classrooms. You know what I mean? These are classrooms for sure. So I want to decorate them as such, which means tables and chairs and... Uh, you know, whiteboards and stuff. So let's see if I can get away with that. Uh, this is not where I store things, Snippy. Wow, you're rusty, man. Speaking of storing things, let's store this iron. 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 Okay. Man, I'm really flying off the handle today, aren't you, man? Mm, not yet. <laughs> not yet! Wow, okay. Calm down. Jesus. Ah! Uh, okay. So, in order to do this, I need one block tables, and I need stairs. Can you not stack? You can't stack signs in this version? Oh my god, I forgot about that. What a throwback. Okay. I mean, I guess the one block tables, you know, you could do the fence thing, right? You get a fence post and like a trap door or a pressure plate or a slab. The slabs are too big, though. But if you, a real life desk, right? You know, you got like that little compartment, right? So I actually have a better idea, maybe, perhaps. It depends on your perspective, as all things do. But, I mean, would it be so bad for me to use bookshelves for this? Wait, what? Oh my god, you have to make them vertically? I totally forgot. I always forget that. All of that, and I made enough for one bookshelf. I don't think I've used these much. I mean, I've used bookshelves a little bit, but not a whole ton. Uh, which... Which is not good, because they are a very useful block. Uh, I do have to remember, though, when I break them, I only get the books back. So that's... I gotta make sure to use them carefully. Uh, I need to make a new sh axe as well, and a shovel. Iron, though... Iron, though... Yes. You know, iron, yes. Okay, iron, yes. I don't care. It's the best resource I have, okay? So, let's go take a look-see at what it might look like if I got me a stair and a bookshelf right next to each other. Uh, alternatively, I can just have, like, bookshelves underneath the black, uh, whiteboard or whatever, so we'll see. So, let's see. Uh, obviously, you gotta do the window seat first because that's the protagonists. So, boom. And then... Boom. Okay. Problem. Bookshelves are bookshelves on every side. If this was modern Minecraft, I could do this with a chiseled bookshelf. It would look amazing. And I'm probably going to do that now, actually. One of the buildings in my town I'm building. But this isn't really going to work that well. I mean, I guess it's not that bad, but I don't know, man. Something about this little Among Us character right here I'm not a huge fan of. So I don't know about that. Okay, that didn't even give me the books. That actually just deleted it. I don't know how I feel about building with those. At least to that degree of... To that degree of... Complexity. I will have to do something different. Oh, man. Okay. Think, Snippy. Think. Use your brain. Use your Snippy brain. But not too much of it. Just enough of it. How am I gonna make a desk a school desk i genuinely do not know 
how I'm gonna do that. Bookshelves, don't, they're not gonna work. It, it's gotta be something wooden. That, that narrows it down a lot, and there really isn't much to choose from. And I can't put stairs upside down. I would have like an opposite facing stair, because that would kind of fit, but I don't think so. Okay, here, let's try something different. There's no iron bars in this version, so that won't work. Is there something that's like that, though? Is there something that's like a stone pillar-ish type of thing in this version? At all. There's redstone repeaters. <laughs> how do I come up with that? I don't know. Is that not how you craft it? Oh, shit. Wait, I think I need a redstone, actually. I think I, think I just need a redstone. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Sorry, microwave brain is working. No? Wait, doesn't it need quartz? Wait, those aren't in this version then. Yeah, no, no, wait. These aren't in this version. Are they? Are they? I mean, quartz isn't. I would definitely have some. But that's not. Huh. Wait. No, repeaters are definitely. They have to be a thing, right? I don't know how to make them is the problem. Wait, 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 I think, I think, if my memory serves me correct, I need stone or stone slabs. Yeah! I remembered! Of course I did, okay. Will this function at all? Oh no, I can't put that there. Oh no. Oh no, I can't put that there. Wait. Oh no. No! Oh no, I can't. <laughs> Admit it though, wouldn't that have been good table legs? Wouldn't it? Wouldn't that be good table legs if you just like, if the top piece was covered enough? I feel like that genuinely wouldn't be too bad. Okay, it would be floating. It's not like it would actually connect the whole way, but it, it would at least give the impression that it does. And that's better than nothing. Because nothing is my only alternative. Okie dokie. I guess what we're gonna have to do is improvise. And I'm very good at improvising. So, you don't use axes on that in this version. So, I, I really actually don't have any other idea of what to use uh, at all. There is nothing. So, uh, what we're just gonna have to do is uh, bite the bullet and say, you know what? We messed. We effed up. We messed. Effed up. We messed. M m m m m m messed up. And I'll also place these incorrectly. Oh, these take so long to break. Oh wait, they they give me wood when they break. Oh God, no! There's not even an actual window seat. Okay, I can see why I didn't do this until now because like, oh man, is this a this is a hassle. This is a hassle. What am I gonna use for this then? Also, how why how much space did I have between them? If this is a chair, this is a desk, there should be a space between, so then it should be here that I do the next step. Is that where I literally just broke them? No. So desk, space, chair. And then there's no room at the front. Okay, well, you know what? That's a- that plan went kaputs. Wait a minute. Damn it, no, it's cause- you can't put a trap door on the top half of a block in this version, nor can you with slabs, and that kills a lot of creative capabilities. Yeah, I know. Where the hell are you, zombie? What are you doing? What are you doing? Where are you? Where are you? You're outside my door. Get the hell out of here, you freakazoid. You just got reverse cursed x comboed. No, it's not cursed. That's the evolution. Okay, it has evolved over time. It has evolved, it has been perfected. You don't even need a damn arrow to do it anymore. I have unlocked that capability.
I have researched, I have, I've studied the form, and I have surpassed my teacher. And now I'm the teacher. That's kind probably more real than I'd like to actually admit. Anyway, I don't know what to do for this. So what we're going to have to do is just be like, you know what? Let your imagination fill in the gaps. Just like old Lego sets. Oh, that's so ugly. Ugh. It's fine. I don't want to, I don't want to harp, 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 I don't want to, um, stick on this too long. We're already dragging this out. So I am going to finish this the only way I know how. Okie dokie. So how am I going to finish this? I wonder, I wonder. There's only one real way to do it. Oh, no. Oh no, it's the outside. Oh no. Well, that makes this harder. Whiteboard. Bookshelves. Some paintings. I forgot the way these worked, and this version is... Not great. This is fine. This is totally fine. Just think of these as, like, anatomy pictures or something, you know what I mean? Just think of them as that. Yeah, if I would, if I could get the right one that I wanted, Minecraft, if you could give me the guy that, okay, thank you. So there you go. And then we need the teacher's desk. There we go. And then we have some spare materials that I thought I would need that I don't. What am I going to do with them? Absolutely nothing, because it's, there's nowhere good to use them besides like a corner. And you know what? Sure. Why not? A, a little, a little resting corner. Yeah, that, that's okay. I mean, this is better than what it was. I think it's fine. I think it gets the point across. Yeah, I think that's okay. I'm happy with that. If anything, I want a little more paintings, but mm, it'll be okay. All right, so that I guess is gonna do it. I mean, that's that's basically everything I wanted to do this, to do this episode anyway. I just wanted a relaxing kind of building little thingy where we, you know, add on to the base a tiny bit. Actually, let's harvest the farm. It's been a while since we did that. I wanted to enhance the base a little bit, you know, add some character to other areas that were otherwise pretty much empty. Can I do my water strat here? No. I can't, and I don't want to, I'm gonna be honest. I like the old way of doing things. I like hitting all the wheat manually. All these spoiled city folk using their water buckets to harvest the farm and I had to do it my own two hands. All right, I don't even care how I trample this, I'm gonna be honest, because we have a hoe to clean, to fix it with anyway. And it only even broke one anyway at all. So it's fine. Yes, okay, that is gonna do it for this episode. You know, we revived Spider Bro. He is, he's back among the living, who knows where he is now. I'm sure we'll run into him again, but Let's try not to let him die again because what that, you know, that that ritual was, you know, it might not work next time. Let's put it that way. If you guys enjoyed the video, I appreciate it. That's not how that works. I can't, I've been starting to say that recently and it's like, wait a minute. What am I going to say after that? What, what like it? I don't want to say that. I don't want to say that. What I should say is thank you for watching. I very much appreciate it, like I used to, and like, I don't know why I stopped. Anyway, thank you for watching. <laughs> I really appreciate it, and uh, I hope to see you again in the future. That's why I'm like adding all these new lines. I never said this stuff before. Why am I saying all this? I don't know. It's because I'm like dragging it out, right? I'm dragging out the outro because I'm not done playing yet because I, I want to put this away, and now I'm ready. Except I'm not because I need to go put the hoe back. How are you doing on this fine day? Okay, wait, no. Okay, let's take it easy. Hold on, Snippy, take it easy. You didn't actually do the goddamn outro yet. I'm like ahead of myself. I've been doing that a lot recently, I feel like. What did we do this episode? We were bright, we resurrected Spider Bro. We did some relaxing house decor. You know, we added some cakes over there in here. We went down here and we made a little classroom thing, which I'm happy about. And yes, we, we resurrected Spider Bro. And we sorted through some iron that we harvested and just had waiting to be uh, put away. We did some base stuff. 
and kind of truly settled back into the style of the place. What are we going to do next episode, though? That's the big question. I don't know, but let's just say I kind of have some ideas when it comes to, like, that classroom I built. I don't know why I got this idea. I don't know what came over me. But I kind of want to build skyscrapers everywhere out of stone and uh, make this place feel a lot better. I mean, that, okay, there really is a lot of, like, grandiose stuff I can do like that. Like, that scared me. Um, I want to, again, I mean, it's on the, it's on the sign in there. That's why I say again. But I want to finish the railway, right? Uh, because I, I initially designed it so that, okay, you have a walking way and you have a railway. And those are dangerously close, but that's fine. Uh, and then I wanted to have, like, you know, railings on the side. Or, I, actually, I wanted these to be tunnels that were in, encased in, like, stone with, like, a glass layer. So, you know, stone, you know, on this here, stone, and then glass, and then stone, and then a ceiling with stone, and then a glass, and then glass, and stone. So, a lot of glass, a lot of stone, tunnels along the whole way. Um, maybe even leaves to let some water in, just because it looks so nice, but... We'll see. Uh, that's gonna require a lot of that. that that's like, that's a, that's a huge project though, and I haven't done a huge project on this version in a while, so we'll see how that goes. But I also want to build pillars, supports under the bridge, because I never did that, and I really want to. It would really make it look nicer. So there's 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 definitely a whole episode I can do on the railway. Uh, I also still need to mine the quarry down to bedrock. I, you know what? I might start next episode that way. Here, how about this? Hopefully, I remember, because I almost forgot this objective today. Um, the whole point of today's episode was to resurrect Spider Bro. I almost forgot that fact starting the recording. Um, but luckily, I remembered in time to actually do it. So hopefully, I remember this time. Start with the quarry and spend the episode working on the railway. Even It might be a little boring, whatever. I think it's fine. I think it's fine, and it's progress that I would like to make. And I honestly think it'd be more entertaining than going mining and trying to find diamonds anyway, because I don't know where the hell I'm going to find them. I feel like I just have to... I feel like I'm going to have to strip mine or something for a while, and I don't I don't really want to do that. Unless I find brand new caves that actually go deep, and I don't. I just don't think that I will, I'm going to be honest, without going somewhat far away. Maybe there's still places by the sand quarry that I haven't gone mining. I don't know. I ought to revisit that area, actually, because it was one of my favorites um, down there by the desert. But we'll go there when we have to. For now, I want to spend tomorrow... Uh, not tomorrow, what the hell? It's like a week from now, actually. But I want to spend next episode working on the railway a bit more. So I'm going to be getting stone and glass. Oh, yeah, by the way. I don't know why I forgot to mention this. I kept telling myself to say this. That speech I gave at the shrine, that was just improv. I just came up with that all on the fly. I mean, you can probably tell. But at the same time, it's not... It's, it sounded like I was reading off a script, but my words didn't make sense to have been written. You know what I mean? So I'm kind of proud of that. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you around. Does that, does my mic pick that up? I, you know, I'll see you around. Wait, is that what it is? Hold on. You know, I always come back. And while I have been snippy, and while I have been snippy, you know I'll see you around, my friend. That's the proper outro. I don't do that one often, though.